Hello guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel Programming with Gautam. So in the previous video, we have seen about for loops and uh, we have seen how we can use them. We'll see more in detail about for loops in today's video. Okay? So let me create a new Python file for loops. Okay guys, I have created a new Python file called as for loops. So uh, first I'll show you how to print numbers in for loop for x in range in the up to 100 I'll print uh, numeric uh, integers from uh, 0 to 100 is 0 to 99 now let me run this for you as you can see, uh, we are just printing numbers from 0 to 99 in uh, just a matter of uh, 1 or 2 seconds. With the help of two, just 2 lines of code, we are able to print uh, 0 to 99 numbers in just 2 lines of code. In just 2 seconds. Okay. So, in the same way, let me show you how to print alphabets. As you know, there are uh, ASCII values for uh, alphabets in uh, the binary language we have ascii values so let me show you what are the ascii values for uh, capital a to capital z the ascii values are uh, 65 to 91 similarly for small a to small z the ascii values are 97 to 122 okay guys now let me comment this and show you the how to print uh, alphabets capital A to capital Z with the help of a for loop we'll start from 65 and end up to 90 I'm sorry guys, this is 90 and not 91. We'll end up to 91 followed by a step of 1 each. So we'll use a char function, chr function with, a, with x. So what will the char function do is it will call the character of that particular ASCII value. So you can see we are able to print capital A to capital Z with the help of a for loop in just two lines of code. You need not write uh, multiple lines of code. In just two lines, we are able to print it. Similarly, if I want to uh, write, give uh, small a to z beside that each and every uh, capital A dash cap, uh, small a like this, capital A, small a. To write this particular uh, type of code, I'll use the same uh, the same for, for for loop with some changes. Chr x plus. We'll take the difference of uh, from of 65 and 97. That is 65 to 75, 10. 75 to 85, 20. 85 to 95, 30. 32 characters, 32 value uh, numbers plus 32. So why only 32? Because we are we want to print uh, uh, capital A, then a few uh, lines with a small a in the same line. So that is the reason we are uh, taking character plus 65. Uh, x is nothing but uh, x is nothing but it is starting from 65 here and going up to 91. Similarly, when uh, x is 91 here, 91, 91 plus 32 is nothing but 123. Okay, guys. So it will print up to uh, 123 here. Okay, let me pr uh, run this program and show you. You can see it is printing uh, A capital A, small a, B, B, C, C. Now, for example, if I uh, want to uh, write 1A, 1 with uh, capital A, 1 with capital B, and followed by similarly like that, how will I do that? Let me show you that also. So here we will take only 26 here, then here we will take x 
that is when x is 0 we need to add 97 to that to print a small a so i'll take 97 here whereas i'll take x plus 65 here because we need to for uh, when x is 0 we need to add 65 to print uh, capital a similarly uh, when i want to print x here so x is nothing but uh, 0 to 26 right so let's print that also here so now let me print uh, this and show you what will be the output okay so you can see we are able to one uh, print 0 capital a small a 1 capital B small B 2 capital C small C in the similar way 25 capital Z small Z but uh, we are only getting 25 numbers what is the reason what might be the reason so because we are oh, printing 0 to 25 and not uh, uh, we are taking uh, the step is count, uh, taking from 0 to 25 here similarly if you if I want to start from 1 here then I'll take x plus 1 here and run this program again you can see it is showing perfectly fine now 1 capital a small a 26 capital z small z okay guys so now in a similar way i'll show you how to print uh, numeric tables uh, mathematical tables using a for loop we'll take input from the user x equal to input enter the number to print the print the table okay so i'll take this i'll convert it into int here because we need int here then followed by for loop for z in range of 10 print x comma into z equals to followed by x into z okay now let me run this and show you so i am taking any particular number guys you can see it will just print it within seconds and give you the output so we are not getting the proper output up to 10 here guys so we need to just uh, we need to start the range from 1 go up to 11 and uh, this step is 1 here ok now let me run this we can take any number as I have already told you it will just print it within seconds you can see it has printed the table of 1 4 5 4 5 4 3 up to 10 here ok there is no need to give step here but still I have given it let me show it without a step so here you can find the two ta table of two here okay similarly you can take uh, it is showing of the table table of 1500 it's going up to 15000 similarly if you don't give this as if i pass this value as x and run this program You can see it is uh, going up to 1500, 1499 and printing this value. Okay guys, in this matter of seconds, I have not given the end point. I have given the end point the same that I give the input. So it is going up to 1499 and stopping. Okay guys, hope you have understood guys. If you have understood, please like, share and subscribe to my YouTube channel Programming with Gautam. Thank you.